good. So, so. That was, that's a story for me. Because. <laughs> great people good morning good morning I hope everyone is having a great day so yeah it is Saturday which is what March 12th and y'all I'm starting off this morning with a vlog this is part of my weekly vlog and if I didn't mention that I am gonna start my weekly vlogs off on Sundays. Starting a new weekly vlog off on Sunday. And it'll be run from Sunday to Saturday. You know, even if I don't even get footage on each day during that week. But I will have a weekly vlog. So, today I'm starting off uh, with uh, breakfast. Um... I'm going to do some grits, maybe some sausage, and egg. I'm not really, I, I like liquid eggs. And I might, no, I kind of want to do like a omelet, but I might not. Just, I got other things I need to get done today. I want to work in my room. And by the way, guys, we got snow last night. But it's right now, it's melting right now. It's not even staying. It's, it's, we was covered. And we probably didn't get but about a, Wayne, babe, we got about what much snow? About an inch or a half, half an inch? Yeah. About a half an inch of snow. And it's so funny, it only snowed in certain areas. You know, um, uh, in the uh, Arklatech, that's what we call the Arklatech, where it sm st snowed in my area, in the area where I work, and then where my daughter works, it didn't snow there. So and she's not far from home. She may be maybe 40 miles from, no, I'm not going to even say 40. might be like maybe 30 miles from, uh, from her house and it didn't snow there and we were covered in snow just maybe an inch or a half an inch but you know that's not normal for Louisiana that much you know we might get it every now and then but it's it's it don't it don't last so yeah but yeah um let me see I'm gonna get I guess I'll get breakfast started and get it going so I'm gonna start off I'm, boiling some water right now for my let me check the camera there boiling some water for my grits and I'm going to go ahead and wash this skillet out then I'm going to make some eggs and do grits and sausage I might do the sausage in the air fryer do you want sausage in the air fryer or you want me to do them on the stove? Okay. So we're going to do them on the stove. Right now they're a little bit froze. Because you just took them out the freezer. And we these here are... Uh, what are these? Jimmy Dean? Jimmy Dean sausage. And then uh, we picked up a box of these from Sam. So these are... And they have, they come in like little vacuum packs like this. It's four in each vacuum pack. Vacuum pack. So, you want all of these cooked? No. Oh, you don't? Okay. So, and I'm making some tea. I'm letting some tea sip steep right now. 
And then I'm also going to start my dinner for Sunday, my Sunday dinner. I'm going to start uh, prepping on that today. And I think I want to share that with you guys. And I sh did share on yesterday's weekly uh, vlog, a part of this vlog is um, the grocery items that I picked up for my dinners. But we didn't do hamburgers last night. We might do them tonight. If not, we'll probably eat out tonight. I don't know. Might do some crawfish. You know, it's crawfish season. You know, Louisiana's big on crawfish, so. I uh, might do a a, a, a a shrimp shrimp ball, and I know the lighting might have changed, you guys, but that's just a part of when you in and out of different areas of your place. But my camera kind of automatically pick up my ISO kind of. I got it on automatic. But yeah, I got that going. Then I got my water for grits.
breakfast that I cook, I usually make omelets with like spinach and all of that with the uh, green peppers, uh, onions and tomatoes and stuff like that. And sometimes I do oatmeal. But today I'm not doing oatmeal. Today is Saturday, cheat day. Okay. So, yeah. And I will be back with you guys in a second. guys um I had purchased these here chips I think I got them from Sam's Sam's Club and um they are the what are they by it say keeping it real made with real cauliflower real food from the ground up it's cauliflower stalks sea salt Snack with a plant-based twist. I was trying to see what brand. They're gluten-free, I know. They're vegan and non-GMO. And let me show them with you guys. Uh, these are the chips right here. And you guys, they are so yummy. So yummy. They are so good, you guys. Let me... um. Get one out so you guys can see. This is what they look like. Let me see. <laughs> Let me get one out so you guys can see. It's so good. So, so, so good. So good, y'all. I love them. My husband was like, really? Y'all, I can... I can I can be vegan. Sometimes I don't even eat meat. I'll, I I eat it if I want to, but I don't have to. And I love veggies. And the things that you've been seeing me cooking is what my husband loves. And sometimes I, instead of me making two different meals, sometimes, but most of the time I make two different meals if I don't want to eat that. And but I'm really not a big pork eater, but I love ribs barbecue ribs i love every the last i have a vlog it might, it might be before this one where i did um what was it smothered pork chops i probably hadn't eaten pork chops in probably nine months <laughs> but at that particular time i had a taste for some and i ate and you know i did cook it for my husband, he's a meat eater, and he loves pork chops, but he don't eat them regularly, you know, but he loves them. Now, I used to love them, but I kind of like trying to give up some things, trying to stay in my healthy range, but a lot of things during the weekday, I don't, how I want to say this, I don't eat. A lot of stuff, you know, just uh, bad stuff. But like weekends, I might splurge and eat a little bit different. But during the week, I'm just usually, you'll probably catch me most of the time, I want a salad. Or I might do some fish. And, um, and I wasn't a big spaghetti eater, but every now and then I get a taste for spaghetti. So I eat spaghetti. And in order for my husband to eat it, I got to do ground meat for him. So... Me, I could do turkey meat, but I'm going to do it one day. He's not going <laughs> to, he probably wouldn't even know the difference. So I'm going to try it. Um, and I do have a story to tell. So I'm going to do a story to tell on one of, something that happened for Christmas. And let me see. 
Yeah, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna let it out. This here's my big DS, D, DS, oh wait, DRS, L, uh, DLR camera. <laughs> Which one is it? Uh, it's an EOS 70D with my Sigma lens. This is my camera here. This is what I film all of my beauty stuff with. But I'm going to try it with my vlogging camera to see how I like it. But I'm going to sit it here for right now on my vanity. So here are my lights to my vanity, y'all. So we're going to see what we can do here for a second. Get this bed together. And I'm just going to take some things out of here. I'm sorry about that. I feel like I'm touching buttons and I don't want to be touching buttons. Okay. All right. Then I got stuff here. And then I got a bag of Bath and Body Works stuff. I have the Energy Aromatherapy Energy that has orange and ginger. Then I have the Aromatherapy Eucalyptus Experiment Stress Release, which is my favorite, favorite of all times. Favorite. I use this faithfully at night. Um, I've probably had four bottles already that I've used. I just changed out a bottle on two days ago. So yeah, and I need to Get them out of this bag. And I got all of these. They was like $3.98, $3.95. And then I have the lavender and vanilla for sleep. I haven't tried it, but I need to go put it one in my bathroom. 
Then I have two of those. And I had one, two, three. I probably had six of these. And I gave them all away for gifts. The um, eucalyptus and spearmint. And I got some other stuff, just trash. And I'm just going to put it in this bag. And trash, trash, trash. Then this is some stuff that I got from, I was sent some things by City Lips. I mean, well, no, it's not City Lips. Uh, what's the name of the company? City Beauty, I think. City Beauty. And they sent me a lot of different, um, this here's a plumping lip gloss. Then I got like a, I guess this must be like a lip. A plumping, another plumping lip gloss in this shade here. And I think I got three and then in another shade. I don't know. They kind of look like they're the same shade. And I've had them for quite some time. Yeah, it's City Beauty. I was sent this to try out. Yeah, and it gives you all the information on it. City Lips Matte Hyaluronic Acid. It's these plumping spears used to skin on natural moisture to give a wrinkle plump up look for, from the inside out. And they're just giving directions. Yeah, City Beauty. And this one here is a matte, uh, I guess a matte lipstick, which is in Rosewood. Let me see if I can. This is the packaging, y'all. I hadn't opened this stuff. But I need to open it. But we'll get into this in another another time. So, yeah. And I need to just... Then I got the Hydro Mask that they sent. It's a line smoothie. And I need to pull this out tonight. And it has a mask that you apply. The Hydro Line Smoothing Hydro Mask. It's just mainly lip products. And what is this? And I'm just going to throw this some um, blue light glasses that I ordered from... Amazon. I'm just throwing away boxes. So yeah, uh, we're gonna get on to the rest of this stuff. I'm going to make room for this. And I did get this too, but I, I, I've been using this. I think I'm out of it. I think I used it up. It's the um, Multi-Action Sculpting Cream by City Beauty. And it's not sponsored, you guys. They just sent me that to try it out. So, yeah, so now we're going to go ahead and tackle some of this other stuff. And I'm going to hang up a couple of my sweaters. And I do use all the velvet hangers. I have these in black and gray. Uh, I got the gray ones for my husband. And I had the black ones for me. But I need to really switch it around. But it doesn't matter. I'm going to go shake this rug out. Yeah. Hadn't nobody been back here, but be just a second.
And I do have some new booties. I hadn't worn these before. I just took them out of the box. <laughs> I'm like, when did I get these? But I got to learn them. I have too much stuff. So that's when you don't know what you got. Since y'all sitting up here on my new Alex drawer from dress up drawer from Ikea, I think I'm gonna put some of this stuff in there. And then I got this whole box of Juvia's Place. Y'all, I'm a big fan of Juvia's Place. She's black owned, so I try to support them all the way around. This here just some Easter stuff, girl. I don't even. I just have a new grandbaby, so I will be able to got some Easter eggs. And then I did share. I don't know how long. And I did share in one of my videos where I received also. A gift from Wonder 2. And they sent me all kind of different things. They sent me foundation, powder foundation, um, lip liners, brush, a kabuki brush. They sent me brow products. So, yeah, I'm going to put all of that up. Okay. I don't know if I showed these boots here that I got from Express. I got them on last year. I think it might, no, it wasn't last year. Might have been last year. A year, yeah, might have been last year. What I do, I stuff them with some newspaper until I order me some, some of those boot clips or either inserts, boot inserts. And this stuff, paper in them, to just kind of have them where they're stand up. I just need some old newspaper that I have around the house that I'm going to throw in the trash. And it just kind of like stands them up a little bit. It don't do any harm to them. And this here are all of my berets here. I have all colors that I ordered from Amazon. <laughs> Y'all look. Too much stuff. So I need to find a place for these. So I just wanted to make the bed up so I can go ahead and put this stuff up and get it off the floor. So I can sweep the floor, which is not bad. And I got lots of stuff here. These are like makeup brushes. So far, you guys, look. So far, you guys, look. I have cleaned the floor. And I got to get something fell behind my drawer here. And I can't get it out. So I need to get my husband to undo this drawer here. I don't know how. So he can, we can get that out so I can push the drawer up. This is a new Alex drawer. I don't know. I had it packed with too much stuff, I think. Yeah. Turn this light down. Because this one here, I need to order the, the light bulbs that are... The light bulbs to this one that doesn't give off so much heat. This one, These bulbs came with this vanity... And I ordered this vanity from a guy out of Texas. He does this. He's really, 
His business has really, really grown so much. I will have his link somewhere on the screen or down below. So you guys might want to go check it out. And he does everything. Now, you even get the dresses. This here came from Ikea. So, yeah, I love it. And it has the lighting on the side. You can go up and down. You turn it off. Then you got, also you have access to plugs on the side over there. Outlet. So, I'm going to turn it off because it is so, it makes me hot right now. And I need to order the right bulbs. If anybody know which bulbs I need to get, comment down below and let me know. I have been searching for the right ones, but I haven't. I, I was on Amazon looking for those. I, I guess they might be the LED light bulbs. Because these here, uh, they give off too much heat. And y'all probably see me sweating like crazy in here from that. And then probably my heater probably is on. Y'all, I uh, did mention to you guys we had snow that came in late yesterday evening. And by the way, you guys, snow is gone. Snow is gone. Snow is gone. Y'all, that's crazy. Snow is gone. I mean, it didn't last. It's like 50 some degrees here today. So that's just really crazy. <laughs> so, your girl is hot. Then I got moisturizer, sunscreen. I really need to come out of this shirt here. Because it's more like a sweatshirt. It's like a lounge outfit. It has a pair of pants to go to it and it says need more weekends and it was kind of cool this morning so I put it on with these leggings that I have on but I'm finna change out and I'll be right back okay you guys I had to just change off into something a little bit cooler and yeah it was just too warm <laughs> to have that on so what I'm gonna do Pull this back. And then I got stuff I need to throw in the trash. Um, this is a 21-22 planner. I think I'm going to keep this. To share something with you guys before I finish up this room. You know, I did pick up a few little things that I wanted to decorate for Easter. And like I did share with you guys this candle in one of my vlogs. But I haven't quite yet. I need to go to my storage building out back and get some of my things out. And I'm going to turn the camera around so you guys can see. This was my winter decor right here. That was my winter decor. So, just a few little stems with pine cones on it. And then I had a few pine cones down here with the candle. And then I had this little rope, uh, I guess what you can call it, a little ball rope, decorative rope that I got from Amazon. So I'm going to go ahead and switch this out. I'm not sure if I'm going to do it today, but I want you guys, I don't know what I want to put in here. But um, I will share that with you guys. So that's. So, yeah, and this here is an arrangement that I'm getting ready for spring right here. I love that color.
Okay, you guys. I'm getting somewhere with this. <laughs> I'm trying. But um, I have boxes and boxes of makeup. So I do have another Atlas drawer that I can put this in. So these here are some of my collections of perfumes here. And some foundations. I just want to put that there. And some stuff that I had here. And this right here is one of my lights. Right here. So, sit you guys here. addition to my wig collection I bought on last year I think or first of last year I need to wash it it's a long one I need to wash it real bad it's not dirty but it's just been sitting here for so long so yeah uh, and I think I'll come to and this desk right here, I got from Walmart. It's like a, I guess you could say like an office desk. But I use it as one of a small makeup table. Because I do have my vanity table right here. But I got to come up with a solution. <laughs> with, in some sense of solution. This room is too small with this bed in here. So I have another room that is empty. But I'm thinking about... Either using that room or moving the bed back to that room. It used to be in that room. My kids took a lot of the, the beds out of here and they brought them back when they went to college. So we just bought new mattresses to go on them. So, yeah, y'all, it's just a lot. <laughs> it's a lot. It's not bad in here. It just, I needed to just straighten some things out. Had to straighten out some things. Uh, I'm trying to see where I can put my other Alex drawer. Mm. It's a it's the like it's coming along, so <laughs> it just was a lot that I needed to just straighten up. It wasn't bad, but just needed to be straightened up. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and take a break. Um, we're going to tackle this. If I finish it up today, I finished some. I've cleaned off this Alex drawer. And I got things in here that I can clean out. And get them out of the way. Um, it just, I've got quite a bit done. And yeah, it's, it's. Quite a bit done, but I'm gonna get rid of this here rack. I got it from Amazon, but I didn't realize how flimsy and cheap it were. And I'm gonna get another one because that one is too flimsy. Because when I do my uh try on hauls and stuff, but I'm just gonna take everything out these boxes and play. Okay, my memory card I had to change out, I had to delete some things. So, yeah, like I was saying, I'm not sure if I'm going to start back today. I just have all of this here just on this bed that I want to just clear out. 
And I'm just going to take everything out of the box of drawing boxes. And I will be placing them in this Alex drawer. And then until I get ready to make um, giveaway boxes. Because I know a lot of this, these things I'm not going to use. I have all of my, majority of my um, Juvia's Place things down here. I showed in a, uh, in a haul video a while, a while back. I hope I uh, probably linked that video for you guys. Uh, it'll be somewhere in the iCard, so you guys can go see that. And then I'm just, and I got more Julius Place stuff there. I got still more things here. Oh, just more Julius. So I'm going to get all of this cleaned out and put it in my Alex drawer. What I'm going to do, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and rest up for a little while. Get this under control. And... I will probably start back a little bit later because I got something else that I need to get done. And then I can get back with you guys as soon as I do that. Or it might be on another vlog. And what I want to do is probably share me prepping my meals for my meal for tomorrow. And that I'll close out that vlog then. So, yeah, so I'll see you guys a little bit later. And once I finish doing what I got to do, and then I'll start prepping my meal for tomorrow. So, see you guys in a little bit. <laughs>
get prepped for my dinner for tomorrow, which would be purple hull peas with okra, uh, country style ribs. I might have some yams. At the, I think I still have yams. I might make yams, candy yams, and what else? And cornbread. Let me prep and get this hit together right quick. And then also I'm going to do squash and zucchini with sausage. I forgot to even say that. So, yeah. I'm finna put on my ham bone for my peas. So, I'm gonna put my ham bone on for my peas. So, this is what I have. So, I'm gonna go wash them up real good. you guys this I'm gonna close this vlog out for this week so don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also click on your notification bells down below beside the subscribe button so you can be notified whenever I upload whenever I upload any other videos so until next time you guys be blessed and don't forget to be a blessing and I will see all of you guys in my next video Bye, guys. <music>